Hey guys, welcome back for another episode with Kindred Soul. Today we've got something new for you. Uh, we're starting a campaign on Dungeons & Dragons Sword Coast Legends. Now I went ahead and developed the character, Queen's Hand, a level 1 rogue. And we're just gonna go through the story mode here, and maybe in the future when I get more used to the game, we'll go and run, play some other people's campaigns. But for now, we're just doing some story. Uh, normal is good for us. Normal is good. So, let's start. <clears throat> and I don't know what to expect from this game. It's the first uh, well-rated Dungeons & Dragons game for a long time. So... We're going to find out what's going on here. Maybe it'll be as good as Baldur's Gate. Legends Maybe tell that after the time of troubles, the elven goddess Sehanine Moonbow wept for those divine souls that fell in the gods' war. From her eyes fell the moon tear, a relic said to contain a moat of Sehanine's divine power. The moon tear was hidden by the elves, but not forgotten. A century ago, two brothers, one gentle and scholarly, the other brash and courageous, sought to find the lost relic. They founded an adventuring guild called the Order of the Burning Dawn and sealed their purpose with an oath to find the Moon Tear and use it to bring light to a world filled with darkness. Not long after they sealed the pact, both brothers were lost and the guild's original purpose was lost with them. Today, the guild offers equipment, shelter, and paying work for adventurers looking to do a little good while they make a little coin. You are one of the Burning Dawn's newer recruits, charged with escorting a small merchant caravan along the high road between the city of Neverwinter and the lawless town of Luskan. It has been an easy journey thus far, aside from the vicious nightmares that have plagued your sleeping mind since the caravan left the city. That doesn't sound good. Bad dreams are common on missions fraught with danger. But I've never had nightmares caught like this. Oh god, no. I'm gonna die. They're gonna kill me. But I'm gonna wake up in the middle of the night and catch them. Right? Am I right? I think I'm right. So I don't know why I said Baldur's Gate before. That was... A very good Dungeons and Dragons game, but what I meant to say was Neverwinter Nights. But uh, actually, that's one hey, I would get very up. much the like to play. Under attack. So let me know what you guys think. If you like this, maybe I'll do Neverwinter as well. What? What's happening? Bellamy is calling for our help. Grab your equipment and head downstairs now. I'll be right down. Let's go now. Okay. Oh, that's a rather large top-down view, okay. Click on the... left click on the ground to move to that location. As you wish. Fair enough. Simple. Okay. At once. Uh, the quest log on the right displays the title of the active quests and any current or completed objectives. If you miss any information, the tab in the bottom left corner of the screen toggle the chat history and combat logs. I can do that. That's really trippy. This has got to be dreaming. I'm right dreaming. away. Of Look course. how wavy everything is. Okay. Can shift things around. That's good. That's As really you good. wish. I, I'm definitely dreaming. Look at the windows and the air. At and once. The flames don't look I real. Can do that. Hold the Alt key to highlight any interactive items. Oh, okay. So that's helpful. Like chess to move to and interact automatically. Okay. Oh. That is very helpful. Take all. Yes. And a potion of healing. I will take that too. Potions and scrolls are automatically added to the quick bar, which is down here. Uh, clicking the up down arrows to the far right toggles between primary and secondary quick bar. Okay. Inventory. There we go. Leather curious. Boots. We're gonna be dual wielding. I said dual wielding. I said dual wielding. 
equip your weapon, armor, and boots by right clicking the items like equip, alternatively double check, or drag and drop the item also equips it. Uh, there we go. Yeah. Do a wheel. Right away. Of course. Yeah. As Darn you wish. right, at right once. away. Okay. Report, soldier. I've begun the search of this floor, sir. And what did you I'll find? guard the stairwell. There must be no survivors. Oh, these are not my friends. Okay. Well, we're gonna... We're gonna kill them. Hover your cursor over an enemy to display their details. Left click to target an attack. Your character will fight until the enemy is defeated or you choose to disengage. Fair enough. So let's turn around and get a look at what's going on here. I think that offers us the I can best do that. view. Hit the space bar to pause or unpause during battle. Okay. I just pushed the space bar as soon as it said push the space bar, so I didn't know what to expect. Use this time to make tactical decisions on target selection, queue abilities, potions, or scrolls, and switch to and manage other party members from the options menu. The game can be set to auto-pause under various conditions, enemy spotted, combat begins, etc. Okay. So we're fighting this guy. Unpause. Ah! That's right, get him. You will oh, pay! we're so good. Oh, get wrecked. Get just fucked. Did he have anything? Any loot? He had no loot. Right away. Which further makes me believe this is a Of dream. course. Unless there's mages or something casting illusion magics, but I kind of doubt it. Pan the camera by holding and dragging with the middle mouse button. It's useful for scouting ahead. Pang disables the camera. Follow behavior. However, double clicking on a party member recenters view and follows that character. As okay. you wish. Ah, hello, Captain. Get wrecked. Oh, you that damage. Pay. Oh, that damage. I'd expected better. And let's go downstairs. Yeah, not a very good captain, are you? Just got wrecked At by once. a level one rogue in open combat. You are a terrible knight. Initiate conversations by left clicking. Okay. Glad what you, you can gotta make it, me, me head. Me. It's about time you joined us. Why would anyone attack us? Doesn't matter. They're attacking. They're doing a damn fine job. I too. seem to disagree with that. Well, now what do we do? When multiple characters in your party. Oh, we need to pause that. Multiple characters in your party. Click directly on his or her portrait by to take control. Use pause space bar to better manage targeting and ability use for your entire party. Bio that sounds like a good plan. So my character is going to go attack the background guy. Yes. Steel serpent. Yeah, you just keep doing that. What can I do for you? Uh, you can go attack that one. And what? And you what? can go attack that one. Ready? How may I Break. Go. Ah, get him. Get him off. <laughs> Yeah. Immune to slash? That seems odd. Why was he just immune to slash? We it doesn't get matter. Out there. <laughs> Discover what's going on and put a stop to it. Objections? Let's do it. Let's do I, it. Yes. I'm in. She's in. For the burning dawn. For the dawn. For the dawn. Anybody have any goods? Oh. Oh, there's something lootable back here. I'm gonna go loot. What do we got? The brazier's empty. Can we do something about that? Do we perhaps have a torch? Here's the kit. Oh, that's my entire inventory. Does anyone perhaps have a torch? No? What, what? do you do? Uh, can I show? You look like the fighter. Steel Serpent. Victorious Surge. What do you need? Mm, you're another assassin what with is me. It? Oh, that looks like fire. Produce flame. On the ritual brazier. Hey, get, get over here. Do it. On the flickering flame, the cast his hand and just quickly hurl that enemy range. On hit, they take 2 to 8 fire damage. Sacred flame. But I want to light it on fire. The brazier is empty. Okay. Yes. 
I guess we'll just leave then. I can do that. At your service. What is it you require? By your leave. How may I serve? There we go. Okay, let's. Oh, what just happened? Oh god. we're not getting out that way. Oh, the door exploded. Do you have any idea what's going on? Whatever it is, it's big. We have to get out there and help as much as we can. Yeah, good luck with that. We can exit through the Guildhall basement, but the entrance is hidden. Some kind of concealment spell. Grab the ritual skull from that chest so we can get out of here. Oh, that's what the brazier is for. Okay. So now, yeah, there's what a is it chest you require? over here. Of course. Okay. Lock picked. Oh, take all. As you wish. Place skull on brazier. Play skull. Put the skull on the Bernie stand. Now what? Oh, there's a the door. Hello, door. At once. Oh, you got a nice basement here, you do. M to open map. Fair enough. I can do that. Right away. Anything to fight down here? Of course. Are we missing someone? Yes. What you need? We are missing someone. Hey, get in the basement, yo. Gil. By your leave. Oh, that's you Gil. wish. Uh, he's a troublemaker. How may I one. serve? At once. I can do that. Right away. Of course. Nothing As you over wish. there. Oh, there's someone here. Hello. Hello, Arnax. What are you Thank doing down God here? here. Do you oh, know what's happening? The guild hall is under attack. We're trying to find out under why. Attack? That doesn't sound good. We should stay together until we can figure this all out. Okay. Keep your eyes. You come with me and use your sword to save me with area. your life. Hidden traps. I can do that. Okay. Right away. Of Hidden course. traps. As you wish. Look out for traps. I can do that. Right away. Where's of course. Traps As you wish. No, the search ability can reveal hidden traps and traps. Click on search in Nettie's quick bar to use her to scout ahead. Well, I've got to have search here somewhere as well. Hmm. Yes. Hide. Party selected. At your service. Well, I'm the exact same thing as her, so I have to have it. Oh, that, that's not what I wanted. Where is search? What is it you require? We must search. Um, I have no idea what I'm doing. It just said quick bar. I thought this was the quick bar. Oh, I'm dumb. At I'm once. dumb. Sorry, guys. Sorry for being dumb. By your leave. I can do that. Right away. Okay. We're of searching course. for traps. Searching. Oh. oh, okay. At once. I can do that. I thought right I away. a trap of course. and died. Could this be a trap? Could it be a trap? I don't know. Disarm that trap, sir. I'm on, honestly good, surprised that worked. Good job. At once. I can do that. Right away. Excellently done. Of course. Of course. I always That's say a dead that guy. Is a that, that, that is a guy see, with I many swords stabbed into him. Yes, many swords. I can do that. Abilities, potions, and scrolls reside in the quick bar at the bottom of the screen. Okay, whatever. Right away. Of course. Yes, yes. As you wish. At once. We already knew that one. Some classes have cantrips available. The quick bar displays the default weapon set left and the active cantrip right. Okay, not important for me. Right I don't away. Do magic. As you wish. Oh, I see some enemies. I can do that. Knock knock. I'm gonna hide. 
Uh, right right away. Of course. At once. Eat something. Get track. Okay. Get track. Anything. Yes. Get him. Get track. Ah. Fire! Get him. Ah. Yes. No! This is not hard. I should have went on hard. Then again, it is a tutorial. It might get harder yet. Okay, make good use of your party during a challenging battle. Pause and cycle through party members to strategic, strategically use their full range of offensive and defensive abilities. That's just common sense, Finnegan. What like is this. it you require? There's a box. What's in the box? A What's in the box? Fabulous a object, scroll of thunder wave in the box. A couple of magic scrolls. That's actually pretty good. I can live with a couple of magic scrolls. Did, did I get them? Did the game just lag or what? By your leave. Okay. That's okay. No, I did not get them. There we go. I can do that. There we right go. Away. Now I got them. Of course. More guys to fight, hey? As you wish. Okay. At Ooh, once. I got hurt. Let's throw a knife at this guy. Blah. Those screams. I'm gonna say the voice acting for this game isn't fantastic. No! <laughs> but it's a Dungeons and Dragons game. I think I can forgive it. Okay, the tracking isn't great. Couldn't exactly get around that corner. Okay, nobody's really dying yet. Yes? Right away. So right away, the game's interface isn't fantastic, but I am having fun with it, definitely. Whether that's As because I love D and D or because the game is I actually good, right away. yet to be of seen. Course. But for now, I'm pretty positive about it. As you it. wish, at once. I can do that right away. Of course. As you wish. Get at across once. that bridge. I can do that. That mist makes it look right really away. laggy, though. The the purpley weirdness of course. is kind of As throwing me off. That's not something I personally would have added to this game. I mean, it, it... Oh, hello. You killed Gandalf. Prepare to die. Why suffer an invasion when mortal fools march straight to me? You die now! Demon! Demon! Yeah. <laughs> such a large voice for such a oh. small creature. Okay, well, he wants Can't to help us. See that okay. they're on the same side. How are we on the same so side? Patient, you see. Play a role, mortal, and all will become. Yeah, clear. well, your mom. Stop the chatter and fight. Yeah. Of course. I don't want to fight him. You're obviously here to die. I shall not disappoint. No. No, Bellamy, you fool. Just take him. Leave me. Oh, okay. So, the inland trade route known as the High Road connects Waterdeep in the south to Luskin in the north, passing through Neverwinter and Port Lost along the way. On the trip up from Neverwinter, this portion of the High Road veers away from the coast through a small set of craggy hills. Still about a day's ride to Luskin for most caravans, this area is an ideal resting place before continuing on through more treacherous terrain. Ah, you're finally awake! That was well-timed You reading. were scaring the horses! You were thrashing around in your sleep! The trail boss thought you were possessed. Oh, I was. So, okay, that whole thing was a dream. I thought so. It was just a big nightmare. Sorry about that. It was a rough night. Tell me about it. I had a nightmare that the world was ending. But I didn't screech and flail like me face was on Shut fire. Shut up, Jarhill. Bellamy says he had the same dream I did. Oh, but that damned halfling was probably just poking fun like he always does. He's a good lad. But you know as well as I, if there's a weakness in your armor, he'll do all he can to poke it. Why did you bring him I on I know. Again? I ask myself the same question at least four times a day. Full of jokes he is, but he can't take it as well as he dishes it out. He's like an Damn angry happens. rabbit, that one. All hissing and gnashing of teeth when you rub him the wrong way. 
but he's a damn good soldier and I'm glad to have him here. That nightmare I had makes me think we might be needing his blades in the coming days. Sounds like we all Aye, had terrible nightmares. Aye, something to mention to Palan when we get to the guild house in Luskin. Maybe he'll give us a foul taste and purple concoction that bubbles loudly and doesn't do much else. Perhaps. Nightmares aside, we got work to do. Got to find that fool halfling and get this caravan packed up and ready to move to Luskin. I'll just leave a No, few you won't. <laughs> we don't get this lot to Luskin by nightfall. We don't get paid. And I'm not going to be docked a wage so you can get your beauty sleep. What do we have the left merchants are breaking camp as we speak. Most wagons are tied up and ready to go. We got a few stragglers that might need a hand getting ready. Bellamy went up ahead to scout the road. Haven't heard from him in a little while. He was cranky with a headache when he left, so I'm guessing he picked a fight with one of the trail scouts. Oh, uh, that would sound about right from what I know of him so far. <laughs> Bellamy would pick a fight with a wall if he thought it was in Aye, his so way. so you know my concern then. Maybe go up ahead along the road and see if you can find him. We ain't got it all day, and if he manages to hurt someone, it ain't coming out of my share. Jeez, you're really concerned with money and not your friends. <laughs> Alright, first impressions of the game. There's a couple of issues with uh, when lots of things are happening, controlling your characters. There's uh, some nice abilities, but it doesn't feel like a classic D&D game in any way. Other than uh, top-down run-around fighting. But it is set in a D&D world. It looks like in the future it's going to pick up to be a good game. Uh, it runs very similar to Neverwinter Nights. Which is about what I expected. So uh, stick with me through the rest of the game. And um, you can see how it plays out. We'll figure out what's going on here. And... We'll get a decent review on this Let's Play, see how the game actually is, because we've only run the tutorial so far, so it's hard to say. Like and subscribe if you like these videos, it really helps me out. Leave me a comment, let me know what you think, and we will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!